Welcome to Metal Gear Solid 5 Tactical Ace Rank. Today we're going to be doing mission number 28, Code Talker. Another personal favorite of mine is one of the more complete missions in the game, because we got both a boss fight, an escort, and a pretty nice escape sequence. So, let's jump right into it. Mission accepted. Okay, this time around we got a little bit of combat coming our way, so... I'm gonna have to equip the best sniper rifle I have in hand right now. It's gonna come in handy with silencer and everything. My secondaries are going to be fine for now for when we infiltrate the mansion. Support-wise, this is the perfect moment to bust out uh, the... Where was it? Oh, there it is. The smoke grenades. They're gonna be perfect for this little sniper duel coming up. Everything else should be fine, and just to give myself a little insurance, I'm going to take the gas mines. Just in case one of the things I'm planning doesn't work. As for the rest of the things, they should be fine too. As for snake, this time around, the sneaking suit is going to be my best option, so everything should be ready and good. Now, for the sake of caution, I'm gonna be going ahead and deploying uh, during the night. Deploying. Boss, make contact with the old man known as Code Talker. According to the Intel team member you extracted, he knows what the epidemic is and how to treat it. You'll find him in a mansion deep in the valley beyond the forest. He's a high value target who's probably involved with Cypher's research. This information came at a heavy price. And you can bet security on site is gonna be tight. Watch yourself out there, alright? Make contact with the target, Code Talker. And if the treatment requires it, extract him to Mother Base. So do I, but if the plan works, I'm not gonna be needing to worry too much. But I do still need to be careful because we got a boss fight coming right about now. Is that boss? It's the skulls. Damn it! So Cypher is behind this. Okay, I'm gonna have to make this little place my area of operation, my little headquarters, or more like my sniping point. So long as I stay inside the smoke, I'm going to be virtually invisible to the skulls. So I say I should probably begin. Like I said, they will lose track of me the minute the, the smoke sets in. The good thing is that those laser sights of them, they make it very easy to headshot them. I mean, it does look pretty intimidating, but at the same time, it's basically their way of saying, hey, here we are, shoot us.
New supplies requested. Supply drop complete. Not exactly what I had in mind, but it gets the job done. That's two of the skulls down. I'm afraid that if they do not uh, go to a certain sniping point I need them to be at, I'm gonna have no choice but to take them all down. And that kind of forces me to go into plan B, which is what the sleeping gas mines are for. This is around the time the skulls take their sweet time to start aiming at me. That's three down. And it looks like... Yeah, they're not going to. Oh well. Plan B it is. Oh! Could this be... Opening? Looks like it is. Or not. <laughs> Just to play it safe. And we got him. Unfortunately, this means plan A is out of the question. There's gonna be no zombie apocalypse for me this time. So, plan B it is. That should make a nice little distraction for our guy with the lantern there. Spotlight. Whatever. Follow the midlight. <laughs> That should give me enough time to get inside the mansion and get to the next part of the mission.
have zero risk security. Looks like they're protecting the target. Why don't you try interrogating them? They might know the target's exact location. doing right now is a little setting up for the upcoming part. If it doesn't work, then it's whatever. We made it through. Well, the first move was to get the hell out of the mansion. Now that we did that, it's just a matter of clearing out these guys. And of course, a little tank that is on the way. But it's nothing too complicated, we can actually deal with it. I will need to move to the left though. Because that's the blind spot of the tank. This is an even bigger problem. Supplies requested. Supply drop complete. Like I said, the, like I've been saying in several videos, the decoys can be pretty overpowered. Oh. 
And there is the tank. I really shouldn't be wasting my... Oh, God. I really shouldn't be wasting my suppressors. I've been calling a plenty of... Uh, plenty of mother base support and supplies. That was mostly to make sure my fight with the schools was smooth. Now this time I need to make as little mistakes as possible because that was a lot of GMP that's gonna be subtracted from my own stuff. It's gonna be subtracted from my main score. He's coming too. Roger that. Please select a landing zone. Support helicopter Roger. requested. And that takes care of the tank. I'm gonna let these guys deal with my inflatable snakes to their heart's content. And there we have it, Code Talker completed with an S rank. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this and I'll be seeing you all in the next one.